Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we have a mixture of things. It's gonna be Shein, some TJ Maxx, some uh, Walmart pieces. It's a relaxed video. I just got home from work. I wasn't gonna film, but I figured let me get this out now because it's gonna be a busy weekend with Memorial Day weekend come around. I'm having a barbecue, I'm bringing my family here, so I'm not gonna really have time to film. And I already have the packages. It's going to be a part two to the Shein because only half of it came. Um, and here's the bag. If you're new here, my name is Jackie. I love to do haul videos, makeup tutorials, home decor, fashion, inspo. Follow me on Instagram, JackieRods105 for, you know, just outfit of the day and things like that. If you're an oldie but a goodie, thank you so, so much for coming back and let's get into it. So I'm just going to take pieces from the bag randomly. The first thing is this bodysuit and it looks like this. It's this beautiful like orange color. It has the snap detail in the bottom. It comes up high and... I haven't tried them on. I'm going to put the pictures of the model. Um, I did get this in a double X only because I wanted the torso part to be a little bit long. I hate when it pulls and I feel like some of the one X's that I have, I've had that issue. So that's the first one. And then I got this. This I wanted because I just thought why not and it's this t-shirt i got it in the extra large it's i wanted this to be more fitted and it says vintage 1977 so i am aging myself because i am from 1977 but i just thought this black with the gold detail something simple that i could wear just with jeans cut off shorts you know knotted in the front if i wanted to the material feels very nice but it doesn't feel like it has stretch so it isn't like t-shirt material but i feel like it'll give like a nice fitted look and it's in an extra large um it looks like it is see-through but i think that's fine for now i think it's gonna be like right there not too big not too small just right and i just love this i might cut this here so it has like a little bit of a vintage look like cut up or something like that i don't know yet but when i saw this i was like i need it because these days what you see is like 1986 1999 19 you never see like 1977 1970 whatever so i was like you know what why not and then i got i got this crop shirt it's just like that i got this in a double x because it's white i don't want it to pull so much and that's how it looks it's just a white bait it's from the back to basics line in shein and i thought something like this with some palazzo pants or like high-waisted skirt or just underneath to cover a little bit you know you can do a lot with these and i'm feeling like with the two-piece sets that i got i'm gonna want something like this underneath even if i'm showing like a little bit of belly i'm okay with that so i got that the material feels very nice love this material this is like that shaping kind of material um basic white so can't go wrong with that okay i did want to try a couple of purses and i picked up this one i've been really like into this orange kind of kick because here's another uh, let's take this out It has the stuffing. I don't really like this stuffing. So, this is just like a little quilted bag. Um, it has to be like shaped and stuff. It doesn't have like anything in the bottom. But, it's like that. A nice, perfect shape to get your cell phone, your lipstick. The inside is just like plain um what i like is the fact that i can you know if 
I wanted to do a cross body, I can do that. Fold it. I wanted to just hold it and have it like this. You can do that. It's a nice size. Um, not too big, not too small. It is that quilting material. Now this doesn't feel that feel um cheap but it doesn't feel like such great quality so you know for what i want it for for just you know a, a little bag to go with some of my outfits like today i have just this tie-dye dress if i wanted to wear this with that i'm fine with it it's a nice size it does have to be shaped so i will probably put something in it to give it a shape but i'm happy with it because I wasn't expecting too much and it's more than what I was expecting so I'm happy with it. I love the um, gunmetal detail. It's not like gold or silver. It's like a nice, you know, subtle kind of bag. I wish it had a pocket on the outside but it doesn't. But I'm still happy with it so you can't go wrong with that. And if you want to put the, the um, straps in the bag and just hold it like a clutch you can do that you can do a lot with it it's a nice size so you know it doesn't have any zipper pockets on the inside but i feel like you know your wallet your cell phone lip gloss you know something like that and you're good to go so i'm happy with this So the next thing I got were these Palazzo pants and these feel nice. I got them in a 1X and it's just like this pattern um, like that. They're kind of like bell. They're so nice. They have beautiful stretch. So I'm thinking that something like this with this top and just like if you want to do casual and you want to do like flip-flops, you can do that. If you wanted to do like um, slides, you can do that. If you wanted to wear heels with them, you can do that. So I just thought this was a beautiful pattern. It's not too loud, I don't think. Like, look at that. So I'm happy with this. I didn't try these on again, but I'm pretty sure these are going to look nice because these are the kind that will pick you up and make you look fabulous so again i could wear these on my days off with like a crop like that or i can wear it dressed up with you know a little bit longer of a top and wear it to work with a cardigan something like that or if you wanted to dress it up and wear something a little more revealing on top those pants some heels and you're good to go so i'm happy with that and then I got this top and this is in a, I want to say, what is this? This is in a 1X and it's just like a tied up, it's got like these bows on the on the top here they don't really cinch anything they're just for looks but i thought this bold color was so beautiful like look at that you know nice and cool with like some jeans white dress pants or white jeans some shorts if you want to dress it down you know some leggings i think this is going to be so nice for the summer and i do have a lot of like loud pieces but i want them for like pieces that have nothing like i have a lot of pants for work that are just like solids that something like that will give it a little something i don't like always to be like solid solid like i like something to like pop out and this is gonna do that and it is like a beautiful silky material um it's probably polyester but it feels so nice like so nice so I can't wait to style that. Um, let's see, let's see. So the next thing is another bag. And it's this green. It's this green. Let's see. 
it's like that kelly green that everyone is like so in love with and i don't even know how this goes so it looks like this it has like um this detail here where you just lock it again another perfect size not too big not too small it has this gold detail and the inside um, it doesn't have any pockets either it brings this gold belt but it's not attached which i'm a little bit confused about i'm not sure how i'm gonna do this but it brings a gold belt i gotta see how it looks on the image i'll put an image of it as well but it's like this beautiful green that i think i can get a lot of use out of because it's a solid and i can wear it with like the floral top if i wanted to wear it just like this like a little clutch i can do that if i wanted to wear a crossbody i can do that if i wanted to wear it just on the shoulders it's gonna look so nice and it is quilted so it's something that if you get food or something on you can wipe it down it doesn't again feel expensive but it doesn't feel cheap so i love this and i think again with like a floral dress a solid you know this is the color that everybody's going crazy over like that kelly green um so i'm gonna see if i find some slides this color that i could do like a whole outfit with um i don't have anything this color but i do have pieces that i can mix and match with it so i love this and how vibrant it is it doesn't look cheap even the hardware looks nice so that's that and then i picked up this little desktop um you can put your ipad you can put your phone on it the box is a little beat up but it comes like this looks pretty simple you put it like that you attach your phone on it it swivels and things like that so this i'm gonna give to my sister because you know we've been trying to do some tiktok videos and we're trying to be consistent with that and it's kind of hard for us to be you know trying to film so i'm gonna take this to her and we're gonna use it over there then i picked up some jewelry pieces and what the hell is this um I don't remember this looking like that. But. So I got these earrings. Um, I don't like this. So this is how they look. They're just like hoops. Actually, they would go with what I'm wearing today. But they just look a little cheap to me. I don't know. But I guess for just being around, you know, in sweatpants or something, just to give me a little bit of like something can't go wrong with that and then i got these which i'm excited about because they're like multicolored. and again if i wanted to do like if i wanted to do like a solid and just give myself something like a pop i got these that's how they look they've got these beautiful colors that i'm gonna get so much use out of even this green with the bag or this floral with the other bag is going to be so nice and i've really been more into hoops than anything else so i'm excited for that and then i got two more items and then we should be done i hope i'm not going too fast but i just wanted to get this out because i gotta go clean the deck and do a couple of things i got another top and it's another white top looks like this it's got a little bit of a mock neck to it another cropped but i wanted something like this that i could wear um underneath like a cardigan at work um just so it's a little more covered and not so exposed again i can wear this with like joggers i can wear it with like palazzo pants anything like that and it looks like this i can wear it something like this like under something that's very low so you know just basic 
pieces that I need for like little things. And then I got this top, which I don't remember getting either, but now that I have the bag, I probably did. So this is another um, kind of cropped. It's like this beautiful green color. And I love this because again, sometimes your bra straps a little thicker. This is gonna work nicely. And I can wear these with like palazzo pants. I can wear it with the bag and maybe some white pants, you know, some slides or you can jeans or just some high-waisted pants, whatever. I thought this was such a nice knit. And I was like, you know what? Let me get something like that a little bit different because the neck is like boxy, but I think it's gonna be nice. So that's how that looks. And I'm excited. So that's everything from Shein. I'm gonna move over to Walmart. I only got a few pieces and I wanted to show you because they were $1. So I got these um, jogger style pajamas. They were on clearance for $1. And I got this top, which I think it'll be so nice together. This one was on clearance for five bucks. And I can wear this out and I can wear it at home. You know, I think this is nice for, again, if I'm home and I need to, you know, just come home and change and I want to cook and I want to do whatever. I'm not really going to care because it was a dollar. It feels so nice and soft this is so nice but again i needed stuff like this for when i come home and i just want to like relax change my clothes start cooking and not worry about you know having to run back out i got another one which was one dollar this one has like coffee mugs it's very soft it's lady sleep jogger with pockets so I feel like the other one I can probably wear out because it doesn't really have anything. But I feel like these coffee cups kind of make it look like it's actually um, sleepwear. So, but for being at home with a tank top, cooking whatever I have to cook, or, you know, if I wanted to run errands and not really get out the car, like if I was going to a drive through or something like that, I could wear this. So I'm glad I found them for $1 because... I wasn't in the mood to um, spend too much. The next thing I got were these shorts. They look like this. These were on sale from $12.99 to $10. And they're just for like running errands and stuff. They do have like the biker shorts underneath. So, you know, you feel like your legs aren't really like, you know. So I got this one. I thought this color was so nice. And again, if I wanted to wear it with that top these and just some you know lime color sneakers run some errands and then come back i could do that um but i thought these were so nice and they're pro they've got pockets um zipper pockets so if you have like your phone or your wallet and you're just walking around town and you want something simple i thought this was so nice and i love the fact that it's not really simple because it's like pew, you know they have so many beautiful colors, but I like this. It's from the Avia line. I got it in an extra large. And then I got these um, crop length leggings. They're, um, they were on clearance for nine bucks from $15.98. And I have the matching top to this that I got last year that I still really haven't worn. That I think together with my white sneakers to run errands or just, you know, I want to be casual on the weekend. I could wear that. Um, it is very light, so it's going to be nice for now. And if you wanted to wear it with sneakers, a white t-shirt, and just, you know, wear it to the gym, you can do that because that's what it's for. But that's not really what I'm going to do with it. Um, and then the last thing I got is from TJ Maxx. I only got two things because I didn't really see anything this time around. I picked up from Avani Gregg with Morphe this highlighter. It was $7.99. It's in the color Cali. And I didn't need this, but I wanted it. It has its package. And it's just this beautiful like sun-kissed um a luminous bronzer 
and I just thought this was going to be so nice because now going into the summer, I do spray my face with matte setting spray not really dewy because now that we're going going into the heat my skin gets oily but i don't want like that flat matte look i do want like that glow and it does have like some glitter in it so you still get like a beautiful glow but you're not like oily looking so i saw this and i was like you know what i want this because i saw i picked up the palette that i showed you guys in my last haul and i love it so I got this and then I picked up this from BH Cosmetics Weekend Vibes in the color in the name Bellini and these are just six blush blushes and look at these colors they're like that peachy sun-kissed I've been in the sun kind of color and I love it so I've been using this one I don't know if you can tell but I've been loving this like orangey color so when i saw this palette i was like oh i need you and they're all peachy colors georgia peach just peachy peachy keen peach a cake life's a peach peach please so this was only 5.99 so i was like you know what let me pick it up i'm in the mood for like orangey kind of blushes right now and that is perfect so i think that is everything that i have I do have another package coming. I think there's two more coming. One is my sister's. She didn't want to try on the clothes so I can film her. But I think she is going to wear one this weekend. So I'm going to take some pictures. You'll see her. And then the next package is also hers. One is hers. One is mine. And we'll see. We'll see if she lets me film her. Let me know what you think about the Shein bags. I haven't really played too much with their bags or their shoes. Except for the ones I got last year um which they were so nice but i found that wearing them they weren't very comfortable but i'm excited for these bags i'm excited to style some outfits now that it's getting nicer so if you're new here and you still to the end please please hit that subscribe button we're trying to hit at least 2000 before the end of the year i want to give a shout out to my girl liz because she hit 4000 on youtube so yes congratulations girl we trying to get there we're trying to get there but she's very consistent so i'm so happy for her everybody else thank you so so much for coming back and i'll see you in my next video which is another haul um but you guys like these hauls because i can see in the numbers that you guys love these hauls so i will see you in the next one bye guys